Don't you miss me, Richie? Because I've missed you. No one wants to play with the clown anymore. Hey, I'm Brian, Slash and Toots. What's going on, dudes? Okay, we got the total Pennywise kill count. That's all his kills throughout his whole killer clown career. So you got chapter one and chapter two, and not counting the TV show or TV movie because that you can't kill the same characters. They're based off the same book, so I don't know. So subscribe here for more kill counts. Let's get to all this good Pennywise kills. Hiya, Georgie. What a nice boat. Do you want it back? Um, yes, please. You look like it. Yeah, see, kids nowadays don't play no rain. They have awesome video games. Like, Georgie, go home and play on your Switch or uh, play that new season of Fortnite or whatever. Don't listen to him, Georgie. You could build a new one. Fuck that old one. Uh, Billy will go make you a new one, dude. It's just paper and a little bit of glue or whatever the fuck. Come on. That's his go-to move, Pennywise. He loves biting people. He bit a couple of other dudes and he bit... Yeah, that's his go-to move because he's got rows of teeth like a shark. And clean bites, man. Took that arm right off. And I think most horror movies have like good lessons to teach kids. Like This is like, don't talk to strangers. Especially scary fucking clouds who hide the sores. See, son, don't talk to clowns and scary dudes in vans. This is probably his best kill of the whole series. See, in the book, it's like the 60s or 50s. It's like, ah, eh, the big scary thing was like the Wolfman and Dracula and shit. But I guess, you know, in the 80s, zombies were big. So, of course, zombies are going to taunt you. And I guess the head from the thing, you know. Or Thriller. Thriller had a bunch of zombies in it. Maybe Patrick's just a secret Michael Jackson fan. Turn to the Living Dead came out by the 80s, 86, 87. So, mm, trash can haunt me anytime. Yeah, Patrick was a bit of a shithead anyway. He was just a bully trying to torment Ben some more. And that's why Pennywise gets you. He doesn't play like that. But yeah, he's a little bit of an older kid than his usual who he likes to eat. Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! And was this the actual Pennywise kill? I don't know. I think I'm going to give Chef Bowers. He's like, Pennywise, that's like assist points, you know? He passed the ball to him, but, you know, Henry actually, like, the points counted for him. And if he really wanted to, in the deleted scene, he killed his other friends in the car, and they were all dead. So, I don't know, man. You want to count two more? I don't know. Fuck it. And right here, we know that these aren't the only people that Pennywise killed. He also killed more that's pretty much off screen. And I'm just judging, I don't know, I'll say 20. If it comes out more or less, I think. See, because when all the bodies flushed out and in Chapter 2, there was a whole bunch of bodies that he killed left over from the 60s. So there you go. <laughs> Yeah, 
for an alien being that crash landed on our planet, he's pretty homophobic. Like, I guess maybe back where he's from, it's cool to hate gay people that much. Like, he even broke his own rules. Like, I think for the most part, he was only killing, like, kids and teenagers. Now, gay, grown men. So right here, I'm gonna call this the second assist. Cause Stanley suicide, you do that to yourself, dude. You know, like Mike called him up and he just couldn't handle the news, but he wouldn't have killed himself if he never ever met Pennywise. He did come back as a head, so that was cool, Pennywise, at least throw him into the end of the movie, but you could have came through and had a couple of beers with the bros, dude. Hello, Vicky. Oh, Vicky, that's so sad. You want your birthmark to go away, but I don't know, man. To be honest, there's ways around it. Like, you know, you could wear a whole bunch of concealer, or you could put your hair down over your face, or come on, man, your mom's got to teach you some tricks. Come on in a little closer, and we'll blow it away on the count of three. One. You're supposed to say three. Damn you, Pennywise. How do you have the audacity to go kill a young, innocent girl like that? Now the big boogeyman will dare kill a kid. Michael, Jason, Fred. Well, Freddy killed kids before he became the Dream Union. But you're out of the union, my dude. Get Hello. Like Pennywise just wanted an audience, man. And look at him, he's so salivated to get that kid. Like those old school strip clubs. Like you could look behind the glass, but you can't touch. Right? Like you had to give the quarter and the theme would come down. I don't know, man. They, those were out of style before even my time. I guess in the 70s, right? Uh, jack off boots. <laughs> Dean kid gets it, man. It sucks. And he just did that because he was in front of Billy just to tease him like I killed Georgie and now I'm killing Dean and there's nothing you can do about it. Like how after a breakup, you start dating your ex-girlfriend's best friend just to show you could do it. Jealous much? <laughs> Mike's plan that brought everybody together was the ritual of Chud because the Indians did it, but that makes sense that the Indians, it didn't work because why is he still here then? So Pennywise kills a whole bunch of Indians and who knows man, this is another sort of like up in the air number. I'm gonna say 20. It seemed like a whole bunch of Indians. Ah, poor Samuel for Eddie, man. It's, he almost lasted almost to the end. He almost lasted the whole thing and ran into that leper a couple of times, but man, your car got pulled, Eddie. I think I killed it. I did. I think I killed it for real. Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. Eddie. Richie. Too bad, Eddie. You're the last one to go, man. The last loser to die, too. Instead of believing in that spear really messes that dude up, you should have believed in bringing a shotgun, my dude. It sucks, man, because Eddie was my favorite kid from the first part of the movie, Chapter 1, but Richie was my favorite part about the grown-ups in Part 2. But there you go. And they were supposedly gay for each other, or at least Richie was gay for him. Alright, so 
we got 44 total kills with two assists. So, uh, you need to pump up those numbers or get some rebounds. And you can have like a triple double, right? But there you go, man. 44. I guess that's pretty high, even compared to Michael, Jason, and the rest. I mean, I think Michael, Michael's in the hundreds and everything. But, you know, different timelines. Maybe they can even make a Painwise Part 3. And we get to know all the people he killed before. So, yeah, you know, 44 at the least. So, thanks for watching. And I hope to see you back for more. And subscribe here. And I will see you dudes later. Later, dudes.